Welcome to our video about how to get rid of tartar on your teeth. If you have tartar on your teeth, it can be difficult to remove without the help of a dental professional. However, you should know that the condition makes it more likely for you to develop tooth decay, as tartar provides a place for plaque to adhere to. This makes certain areas in your mouth impossible to brush. Keep watching to learn some steps to help you get rid of tartar. In addition to this, you should also know the signs of underlying dental disease. Lessons learned from removing tartar buildup on teeth. Having trouble removing tartar buildup on your teeth? Here are some tips for effective tartar treatment. The first step is to understand what tartar is. It is a plaque in a hardened form and is far more difficult to remove. To avoid forming tartar, use anti-tartar toothpaste and extra brushing near the salivary glands. If you find that your teeth are very sensitive, you should buy special toothpaste for sensitive teeth. This will prevent sensitivity from increasing because it is a sign that something is wrong with your teeth. If you are unable to remove tartar on your teeth on your own, you should see a dentist for a professional cleaning. Performing this cleaning at least twice a day will help prevent tartar buildup. Your dentist can remove the tartar before it can form. You can also use fluoride toothpaste that will help strengthen the enamel on your teeth. The first step in removing tartar on teeth is to brush your teeth for 2 minutes twice a day and floss once a day. Tartar is a sticky biofilm formed on your teeth. This film is made up of bacteria in the saliva that interact with starches and sugars on your teeth. The bacteria produce acid that erodes the enamel of your teeth and makes them susceptible to cavities. The second step is to remove tartar, which can be more difficult. If left untreated, tartar can lead to gum disease, cavities, and even tooth loss. The best way to prevent tartar from developing on your teeth is to keep your gums healthy. Tartar can damage your teeth over a period of months, so cleaning them is essential for your oral health. If you do not, you risk developing periodontitis, a serious condition that can lead to tooth loss. You can prevent periodontitis and prevent it by following good oral hygiene habits. If you have problems with tartar buildup, see a dentist for a tartar-controlled toothpaste. Regular dental visits are also essential for tartar removal. Most dental offices recommend six-month cleanings. Not only will this reduce your risk of developing cavities and gum disease, but it will also help keep your teeth strong and white. Those who practice daily brushing and flossing will have a better chance of preventing tartar buildup on their teeth. You can also gargle with vinegar, which has antibacterial properties and helps prevent tartar from forming on your teeth. Getting rid of plaque on your teeth is essential for preventing gingivitis and cavity development. However, tartar is a different issue altogether. While you shouldn't brush your teeth every day, plaque buildup on your teeth can cause a bigger problem. Tartar is basically the same as plaque, except that it is a much harder substance. If you don't care for your teeth, you could end up with a permanent case of tartar on your teeth. Signs of underlying dental disease caused by tartar buildup the mineral deposits from your saliva are the foundation of plaque, which bonds to your tooth enamel. If this layer becomes too strong, you will need a dental professional to remove it. However, you can remove plaque from your teeth yourself at home, but tartar requires a dental professional's expertise. Tartar is a yellow or brown biofilm that is tightly bonded to your tooth enamel. You may experience an increased risk for tartar buildup if you have braces or a dry mouth. Other risk factors for tartar include aging and crowded teeth. A sticky film called plaque builds up on your teeth, causing the teeth to become discolored. Over time, this plaque hardens and forms a tartar-like substance. Tartar is a symptom of underlying dental disease. This type of buildup is caused by plaque and can also be a sign of other health problems. It is best to visit a dental professional if you notice any of the symptoms listed below. The bacteria in tartar are not pleasant to ingest, but they will damage your gums if you don't clean them regularly. If left untreated, tartar can lead to gingivitis, a mild form of gum disease. However, with proper care, gingivitis can be reversed. Periodontitis, on the other hand, causes pockets to form between your teeth and gums. It can lead to loss of teeth and painful gum tissue. If you notice any of these signs, visit a dentist immediately. Tartar buildup is a symptom of underlying dental disease. The buildup causes a low pH level in the mouth, which causes inflammation of the gums and tooth enamel. Additionally, it is another sign of gum disease. 
getting a dental professional to remove tartar is crucial in preventing a tartar causing disease. As plaque and tartar buildup continue to build, bacteria in the mouth can invade the tissues surrounding the teeth and lead to periodontal disease. The bacteria in tartar then form a sticky film on the surface of the teeth, known as plaque. If not removed, tartar can cause sore, bleeding gums, and painful chewing. Only a dental professional can remove tartar without causing further damage to the teeth. The presence of tartar and plaque above the gum line is a sign of underlying dental disease. This type of bacteria can damage the gum tissues and lead to the loss of teeth. If left untreated, tartar and plaque can lead to gingivitis, which is the first stage of periodontal disease. Although gingivitis is reversible, it can lead to periodontitis, which is the first stage of periodontal disease. Ways to prevent tartar buildup One of the best ways to avoid tartar buildup in your teeth is to practice good dental hygiene. If you don't brush and floss your teeth regularly, you may end up with more tartar than you need. This is because plaque, also called calculus, builds up on your teeth and combines with the minerals in your saliva to form a hard coating. Unfortunately, tartar can even settle below the gum line, making it difficult to clean your teeth properly. Furthermore, if this process continues, tartar may begin to develop on your teeth, resulting in gingivitis or periodontal disease. Besides brushing your teeth daily, another way to avoid tartar buildup is to use foods that contain polyphenols. These compounds inhibit the bacteria's ability to produce acid, which damages enamel and causes plaque. Foods that contain polyphenols include dark chocolate, star anise, cloves, flaxseed meal, red wine, green tea, and cranberry juice. If you want to brush your teeth, you should brush them after eating a meal. You can also mix some white vinegar with warm water and gargle with it every day. In addition to daily brushing and flossing, you can also try natural remedies for bad breath. Baking soda and vinegar mixed with water can help get rid of tartar. These home remedies can also help prevent tartar buildup in your teeth. Just make sure to avoid consuming too many sugary foods or too much tobacco. Keeping your mouth healthy with these measures will ensure that your smile looks great for many years to come. In addition to brushing your teeth regularly, you should also visit a dental hygienist at least twice a year. Your hygienist will be able to recommend some ways for you to prevent tartar buildup. Among these, brushing slowly is the most effective way. Don't forget to use soft bristles while brushing your teeth to reach hard to reach places. The American Dental Association recommends brushing twice a day, at least two minutes. If you can, use a good toothpaste with fluoride and anti-plaque ingredients. And remember to floss your teeth daily as well. Brushing alone won't get rid of all the plaque, so flossing is crucial. Even if you don't have the time to brush your teeth twice a day, you should still floss your teeth as often as possible. This prevents tartar from forming in your teeth and is essential for maintaining oral health. The best way to prevent tartar buildup in teeth is to brush regularly. Brushing and flossing daily is important to maintain healthy gums and teeth. However, it is also important to visit the dentist every six months for a scaling procedure. Professionals use a scaling instrument to remove tartar buildup. This is a painless procedure and requires minimal time. However, it is important to remember that tartar is not completely removed by brushing. Brushing twice a day with fluoridated toothpaste can help eliminate tartar. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more.